Hello friends. Welcome back to our channel. I am your React JS instructor and my name is Kumaresh. Thank you for connecting with us. Hope you are doing well. Let's start our today's session. Throughout this tutorial, we are going to learn how to pass the props to the parent components from child in React.js. Or in other words, how to render parent from child component. The props are nothing but the arguments which are going to pass from one to another components. During the explanation, first, we will create parent and child components in the React project. Then we will call child component from parent. After this, we will pass props value to parent components on button click event, which means render parent from child using state variable. At the end, we will display the props value in parent using the state variable. The entire explanation will be done through a demonstration example of React Hook. Let's start with the demonstration. In this existing React project, the highlighted text child component is displayed from child component and the sample React application header is displayed from parent component. We will create a button in child component which will render the parent component. By clicking on this, the title displayed from parent will be changed with the help of state variable. To do so, we will first define a state variable in parent component which is app.js in this aspect. We will define state variable using the React hook use state. We will now create the state variable as title. Assign the default title value as sample react application. We will replace the header text with the newly created state variable. Save the changes and check if the application is working as expected. Now we will navigate to the child component child.js. Create a button in this child component. Provide a name such as change parent title. Save the project and navigate to the web application to check the appearance of the button. We will now add the mechanism to render parent from child component. For that, we need to add the on click event on button. Here, we will call the self calling props .change title property method of the child component against the on click event of the button. This statement has the ability to render the parent component from where the current component has called. We will pass the new title as changed parent title from children. Now, we need to modify the parent to define this change title property method and update the state variable. 
save and navigate to parentapp.js component. We will define the change title property method here. We will call the state variable method set title against this event to update the state variable with the data received from child. Save the project now. That's all about passing the props to the parent from child component. Now if we click on the button available in child, the highlighted text will be passed to parent and change the title of the application. The new title value will be updated into the state variable in the parent app component which will be rendered and visible in the web. Let's verify the same from the web view. Click on the button and we can see the result here. Thanks for watching this video. That's all about passing the props to parent component from child. We will learn more about React.js in upcoming videos. Please visit our website lambdageeks.com for more articles on technology, engineering, mathematics, and various other domain. You can check our other website as well. We have features like YouTube trends, Twitter trends, scientific calculator, and many more other tools. If you like our video, please like, comment, and share. If you have any questions, please comment and we will resolve your query.